What is up people? Skywalker Hendrix here, back with another video for you guys today. And today I am going to show some uh, easy ways to upgrade your collection. Um, this is something that I've been wanting to do for a while and finally took the plunge. And it honestly, in my opinion, especially for the Darth Vader figures, has 100% enhanced uh their look on the shelf and just the overall look of the figure in my opinion i think these really uh if you haven't noticed it's it's i'm talking about wired soft goods um me personally i do not really care for how soft goods look overall some scenarios i think they do work but Overall, I think they just don't really work in this scale. And I've found a person in the community named Daredevil19 Customs. Uh, I highly recommend going and DMing him on Instagram and uh, seeing, you know, what he has in stock. Uh, I highly recommend his Vader capes. I have gotten them for all of my Darth Vader figures and they just look so, so amazing. Uh, I think Vader's cape is almost a character in itself. I think it has a lot of weight. Not in the literal meaning, but I think his cape just really can make or break how a figure looks. And I think Daredevil 19 Customs capes for Darth Vader just really hit that mark and add that extra oomph into the action figure and make him look, you know, in in the movies and the shows, his cape is just, you know, it's almost a character in itself. And I just think he really captures that in his work. And his work is just really, really amazing. Um, this is probably going to be a shorter video, but looking at this Ahsoka, fully wired, uh, the hood does come up and, you know, wired hood as well. I just think it looks a little bit better down, and obviously I don't want to cover up that amazing head sculpt. But yeah, this thing is just fully wired, you know, you can put it wherever you want, and I think it was, I think it was a really, really needed for this figure i think her cape or her cloak was something that we were really missing in the line and man i just i think it makes the figure way better and um his prices so his his capes cloaks whatever are about the same exact price as a black series figure which can to some be like, oh, why am I spending that on, you know, a little cloak to add to the figure? But in my opinion, I think it just adds a, a, a lot to the figure. It makes them look way better. I mean, you can't tell me that you want, don't want this on your shelf. So I just, I love this Ahsoka cloak. I think his his work is just immaculate. Uh, he just really nails that, that, uh, cloth, cloth, uh, feeling, but also that it looks good in this scale, you know, we can sometimes see with the Black Series how hoods, stuff like that don't lay the correct way, whereas his hoods, you know, you can make them lay, you know, nicely, and I think, you know, it takes some finagling and some fidgeting, but I think you can make it look really good, and I don't know, I just think it looks so much better than what Hasbro is giving us, and, you know, I don't expect Hasbro to give us this nice quality wired, you know, soft goods, but as someone who uh, I kind of, I like the sculpted plastic a lot more than soft goods on 
figures, you know, just mass release figures. I think the soft goods just don't quite get it done. And I think Daredevil 19 Customs just gets it done, in my opinion. I think his his work, again, is just so good. And a little bit of... This is a little bit of uh, uh, behind the scenes. But when I was buying all these... I mean, as you can see, all these Vaders have his custom cape. And when I was purchasing these, he, he asked me after about the fourth or fifth one... He was like, man, how many Vaders do you have? And, you know, I do have a Vader for each of the original trilogy shelves. So that's three Vaders. And once I got one of these capes, because I just started with one, I couldn't stop because it was like every time I looked at the other Vaders with the, you know, the stock, let's call them stock soft goods. Uh, that came with the figure, it just, I was like, man, I need another wired cape, and one thing you will notice is that his capes do have the chain, um, which is not accurate to all Darth Vader's, but in this case, I'm willing to sacrifice a little accuracy, because I mean, look at that, guys, I mean, come on, you can't tell me that just, that just doesn't look absolutely fantastic, and of course, they are all wired very nicely, fully wired. So if I grab this one, this is the one that I do have kind of posed up, uh, kind of in the wind almost, and it just looks so good. I mean, you can't you can't tell me it doesn't. And so I I had to get them for all my Darth Vaders, and so that is that is why we are here. Um, I just, even in a neutral position, just, you know, draped around him, I just think that looks so much better than what we got in the stock soft goods. And, you know, uh, so I have three Vaders for my uh, OT shelves because I do display them by the movie. And then I do have this last one. Uh, this is, I think, my fourth, yeah, my fourth Vader that I have in my collection. And this is the Kenobi Vader, of course. And still planning on upgrading this, giving it a custom uh, damaged head sculpt, which I will probably make a video on that. Uh, I'm, I got some stuff in the works here. So, but yeah, just super happy with, with his work. And I... I can't give him enough praise. I just think that he does amazing work. And I think everyone needs, at least everyone needs some Vader capes. So go hit up Daredevil19 Customs on Instagram. Uh, I'll try to link him in the description. Um, but it is just Daredevil19 Customs, all one word, on Instagram. Go hit him up. Go get some custom wired soft goods and i promise you you will not be disappointed and it will upgrade your display so yeah let me know down in the comments what you guys think of these uh wired soft goods and let me know if you plan on getting any for your figures i know some people don't like messing with their figures but these are all super easy uh to you know to put on your figures uh, the Vader, you just snap the head off, or pop the head off, slide the slide the cape over the neck peg. Super simple, and there you go. No glue, no you know ripping pieces off. Um, just a simple pop the head off, put the cape on, and you're good to go. And yeah, I just think they look amazing, and love this guy's work. So definitely go hit him up. I hope you guys enjoyed the video today, and uh, I'll see you all in the next one. May the Force be with you.